Hey, what's up, YouTube? I just want to do a video here. I was going to make this into a podcast, but uh, I'll just do a video. I'm getting ready to head out and grab a load going home. So, I want to title this video, The Rules of Engagement. And a lot of times we hear the phrase, own nothing and control everything. We hear that and, you know, sometimes we may know what it is. We may not know what that means. Um, we say, yeah, 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 I heard that before. Um, but what really does it mean? So I'm going to use Donald Trump as an example. Everybody knows who Donald Trump is. Um, the big topic with him is right now, okay, he's running for president and the red flag goes up because he's had four bankruptcies. Um, let's break that down a little bit. Donald Trump personally is not bankrupt. The company or companies that he formed filed for bankruptcy, not him personally. So he's just controlling his corporations. Now they may be in his name, but the way that it works and you separate your your person from your business you know with the corporation so that's what mr trump did all these other companies um whatever company that you see uh llc or inc or after after the uh the you know the company name then you know there's a comma then the inc or whatever the company is their own entity. It's like it's forming another person on paper, paper and ink. That's all. It's just paper and ink. That's all it is. Um, so you may be advised to do the same thing. Now, I will put out this disclaimer. If you are, if you are the only person in your corporation that does everything, you're the worker, you're the, the, the accountant, your everything. If something were to happen and you're the only one, you don't have any employees, uh, you can be responsible for, uh, they'll come after you personally. Um, so just keep that in mind. But from a tax standpoint, it may be advised that you form one of these you see it i know this stuff is boring i know they it's talking about juicy stuff and they talking about money and and stuff like that i know it's boring but um the system is set up in your favor you just have to know the rules of engagement and learn how to play the game now it, just a little background with me i've been studying this stuff for for years, uh, I don't know, since 2009, something like that, um, studying how corporations work, you know, different uh, tax advantages from for this thing or from, from this corporation uh, or this filing and that filing and this and that. So and I don't know everything. I just know what I've done in the past. I know it works for me. Um, so it's just something to keep in mind. So. When you go to start your trucking business, okay, yeah, you need an EIN, EIN number, employee, employer identification number. But you have to go beyond that if you want to take advantage of the system. Yes, I just said it. I said it. I'll say it again. You have to form a corporation if you want to take advantage of the system. All right, I said enough. I'll leave it at that. Have a good one. <laughs>